I do remember my trip to the EU last year, even two years ago, when we discussed an idea of having Marshall Plan for Ukraine. And the message was as follows, it's better to have Marshall Plan instead of Marshall Law. And uh, what we are doing, we are trying to grab the support from all our partners, the United States of America, and we truly appreciate everything you are doing for us. European Union, Canada, the UK, G7 member states, all EU member states, and everyone who contributed for the future of Ukraine. The thing is that we are not just begging for cash. Give us another loan to repay the previous one. It won't work. What we need in this country, we definitely need to weather the budget storm that is ongoing, but we did a lot in order to um, close the fiscal gap, in order to present to the House a realistic budget, in order to balance the fiscal stance of Ukraine. The thing is that we are out of tools, and my government is out of tools to boost an investment, to boost an economic growth. That's what is needed. We, the best Marshall Plan in this particular case, please invest into Ukraine. Let, let's probably elaborate on the spot areas where to invest in. Let me start with the energy sector. Last year, the House passed a special bill that allows only EU and US based companies to invest into Ukrainian gas transmission system. This is, in case if you decide to jump in, this is to be a new type of energy policy. And that's great that the EU started an uh, antitrust investigation against Gazprom. Ukraine did the same, but the best reply is just to reshape this energy map of Europe. And to say, look, everyone is to, who is to stick to the European standards and to European uh, laws and binding obligations, they can, he can easily operate in Europe. If no, well, go to another streams that you try to build. Agricultural sector, and, and this is another key area for our future and joint cooperation with everyone who wants to invest into Ukrainian uh, eco economy. We can produce perfect, uh, ecologically pure and very competitive agricultural products. What we ask for, we ask for investment investment in Ukrainian agricultural sector. Uh, we truly commend and appreciate uh, our, I would say, educational collaboration with the European Union. And we expect that this will bring us more IQ to move the country forward, to implement reforms, and to be more competitive in this world. So, uh, wrapping up, we definitely need the Marshall Plan. And I believe that this conference is the first step how to facilitate comprehensive, large-scale and two-way Ukrainian plan for our joint success.